Tiger Tim, we talked about Rodrigo Munez at half time. Two goals for him today, seven in seven. Mm. Looking ahead to next season, because Fulham are safe and they probably won't make Europe, do they need to start really building this team around him? Absolutely. I mean, they brought him in two years ago and, and, and it's taken him a while to kind of come to form, but why not? I mean, he's, he's been fantastic. And I think it's, you know, one, once Mitrovic went, it was like, who's going to fill this void? Is it going to be him and as they brought Broya in? But this is their guy. And, and, and not only that, it looks like the current team is loving the fact that he's working hard for the team, getting amongst the goals. I, have, I see no reason why they can't build around him. Brazil player yet to be capped for the Brazil national team, apparently could be on the cards for when they take on England in a yeah. week or so. Robbie, Tottenham, how can you go to Villa and win 4-0 and then go to Fulham and lose 3-0 in the space of seven days? Um, because physically and mentally, you don't prepare for the game in hand. And that's what happened today for, for Tottenham, Rebecca. Um, Tottenham went into today's game looking down the team sheet, saying, we're better than these. Let's go out and we'll knock the ball about. They played with no speed, no urgency, no drive, no desire. By the time they did, they had a couple of chances, couldn't finish them at the other end, end of the pitch. That Spurs team looked like the Spurs team that was decimated by injuries and suspensions. And we had a reason to say, well, they can't quite play. Today, there wasn't that many big players missing and they never really got to grips with the task. I mean, you used at halftime the word complacency. Yeah. Tim, complacent in the Premier League, especially when you don't have any other tournaments or competitions mm. to play in. That's unforgivable, isn't it? Not to be ready. Well, it's unforgivable because, because Rob, you talked about there was no speed to the play. Like, Costa Cogu doesn't ask a lot of them. He basically says go forward, pass forward, run forward, run out of your slots. It's actually quite easy to play in that Tottenham team. And, and I mean that with respect. Like, there's not a lot of responsibility going the other way. So the fact that you aren't playing with speed, that you, you seem to be a little bit complacent, is almost unforgivable in this Tottenham team because that's all they're really asked to do. And as you say, other than Mickey van der Ven, pretty much everybody was back for Tottenham as well. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. And for even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock. And be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you there.